But what's up you guys? It's Adana. Welcome back to my channel. So I wanted to talk to you guys about the Panry and the Panry LA. So I'm not yet ready for a recertification, but this is definitely something that I've been thinking about um, because y'all like I've been a PA for like almost five years now, right? When, when did I graduate? 2019, 20, 21, 22, 23. Yeah, like it's, I'm going into my fifth year, which is bananas. Um, so uh, this is something that I have to like keep at the forefront of my mind because very soon I'm gonna be eligible for recertification and if you are already eligible for recertification and you need some help in terms of like your studying because like it's out the door this video is for you so let's get in the video right now All right, so let's talk about the Panery and the Panery LA. So the LA is the longitudinal assessment one. That's the one that you like do at home. You're not going into um, an actual like test site to sit down and do the test, right? And so uh, it sends you like a certain number of questions each month and you fill out the question over a period of time um, and then you know they give you your assessment on whether or not you pass that block and like if you pass the block you move on to the next block so that is the Panry LA aspect and the Panry is just your typical Panry that you you go in just kind of like similar to the pants you go in you sit down in a testing mode and you take the exam now um, obviously just like with any board exam um, recertification is very stressful and you need help you need like resources and tools to help you get through okay so I'm, I'm here to provide that for you uh, Raj Review has created a Panry and a Panry LA Cubing. now I I love Ross Review I've always said this you guys and I just love the fact that they continue to grow with us as a PA profession in terms of our standardized testing and the things that we're learning and the things that we need to know um, and then you know they keep providing resources for us and this resource is something for you know your seasoned PA that needs to recertify and if you are trying to recertify and you're like man I don't remember like the, the murmurs, right? You know, like I, I'm a PA in women's health, right? <laughs> Close to home. I'm a PA in women's health and I don't really deal with like the heart murmurs like that. Um, so I don't remember like the love dubs in terms of like where I hear like, is it S1, S2 or anything like that? This will help you with that because it, it, it gives you over 2000 questions. You have access to over 2000 questions um, of all the different subjects in terms of like musculoskeletal and peds and women's health and emergency medicine and cardiology, um, you know, the things that in the specialties and areas that you don't necessarily work in on a consistent daily basis, but you will be expected to know and be tested on when you're doing your recertification. So this does that. Um, and it's really nice because you also get a, like you get CME credit, uh, you do get your category one CME credit uh, if you take the standard or the premium package. So there are three different packages, basic, standard, and premium. They come at different pricings, $399, $589, $689. Um, and the pricing obviously, like the jump in price gets you more things. So you continue to get like your questions, your over 2000 questions and your uncommon delights, which are those like extra added little bonuses, right? But at the standard package, you get your 100 um, AMA Category 1 CME credits, which is amazing because you need that to keep your certification. And speaking of, like, I have to, like, finish my certification for this year because, again, like, I'm about to be, like, I'm not, like, I'm going to be, like, a teen, a teenager PA. <laughs> no longer a baby PA am I so uh, that's actually pretty cool um, but yes anyway so standard is 589 you get your 100 CME category 1 credits and then if you go to the premium aspect of things you get everything that you got in the standard but you also get um, like an AME self-assessment with 20 CME credits um, and then you get like a little bonus of a thousand additional credits um, questions and so uh, in all like for the premium you're getting over 3,000 questions and then in the standard you're just getting like you know the 2,000 questions so uh, it's very very nice um, I, I love the aspect of just being able able to continuously have um, 
I guess you can say access to all of like the newest not only treatments but like how to like source out these various different diseases right and just being able to kind of like remember and retrain yourself to be like oh okay yes I do remember that and that's what that was saying that was what that was talking about and I do remember this from you know 10 15 years ago when I was in PA school um, and now I, I get it and this is making sense to me and I can grasp this for my recertification. So if you are interested or if you are in like the mode of I need to figure out what I'm doing for a recertification, I absolutely suggest this because it comes with a free trial. So you can try it free for 10 days. Um, and that's like an ample amount enough of time for you to actually, uh, you know, do a really good assessment of the product and see if this is something that is going to be beneficial to you and your learning okay so like don't even like really think about it just do it like Nike okay <laughs> just go ahead start that free trial and if after the free trial which I know you will actually see the benefit of it but if after the tr free trial you see the benefit of it then go ahead and um, purchase the package that works best for you all right, if you have any questions for me, you guys know what to do. Leave them in the comment section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow my Instagram on, no, follow me at Instagram on Adon. Follow me at Instagram, no, follow me on Instagram at Adon the PA and on Instagram at Get That's University. Thank you guys so much for watching. I will talk to you guys next time. What is going on? I'll talk to you guys next time.